Um, first of all, I look bald. I thought this was gonna be a good hairstyle for this, but okay, apparently not. Anyways, thank you so much for literally blowing up my channel overnight. I've been just sitting in my bed crying and I can't believe it. And thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my god. Anyways, <sighs> so point is, we are going to film a new video today. Finally, um, I'm going to do one of my all-time favorite activities, which is trying on shoes. So we're going to do a designer dupe shoe haul because um, if there's one thing I know, it's how to get cute shoes for less. So check it out, designer dupes, shoe style. started out with these one of my favorite pairs of shoes ever um these are the Balmain Ava booties they're so stinking cute um look at these omg they've been on Miss Chloe they've been on Black China they've been on Nicki Minaj they're so cute and now they can be on you because they're practically the identical shoe from Lola's Shootique same exact suede same buckle closures same style completely and these are a whopping $36.99 and one of my favorite pairs of shoes in the history of ever, these caged fishnet looking booties from Jimmy Choo. I first saw them on Kylie Jenner when she posted them and I died. I was like, I need to own these. But of course, um, you can see the price tag. Who has $2,000? So I made an admission to look for them. I looked for bajillion years until I finally found some, but ta-da, of course, Lola's Shootique always coming through for me. I just adore these. They literally look like fishnet kind of boots and I am obsessed with them. All right, so this is one of the hottest trends right now is these sock boot things. Why? I don't know, but you know what? As someone who's totally into it, who needs an explanation? You don't need a reason to want to look fabulous. So yeah, these sock boots are $1,260 on Nordstrom, um, so yeah, a total ripoff. Um, they are super cute though, so. I first saw this look on Rihanna, and this was one of those looks that just shakes your life. She is just such a babe, wow. Girl crush, anyways, back to the sock boots. Ta-da! These are a basically exact dupe. Um, I'll show you what they look like on because it's kind of hard to see. And granted, I did get the pink ones just because I wanted to shake it up, but they are identical to the Vetement brand. Like, they're so stinking cute. All right, up next, we have courtesy of good old affordable Bergdorf Goodman, um, the Valentino Rockstud leather pumps. Perhaps the most popular celebrity shoe style ever. Who doesn't have them? Everyone has them. Anyways, um, so yeah, at Bergdorf Goodman, these are $1,000, $995, I guess, but check it out. You can get a pretty much exact dupe for 30 bucks. All right, these shoes are some amazing brands. Look at how cute these are. They got the clear thing that's like so damn trendy right now. Um, let's see. Well, these are out of stock because my beloved Kimberly Kardashian was wearing them once, so they sold out like immediately. Um, but these are $745, but these are an exact dupe, basically. Um, I got them in nude because I prefer this color than black. These were... Ooh, I don't remember how much. I think they were like $32 um, at Lola's Chutique. Oh my god, I love these shoes. <laughs> okay, so for this one, we're going to do a double whammy because I liked them so much. I had to get them in like every color. Um, these are Giuseppe Zanotti, if that's how you pronounce it. I really don't even know. Um, Luwala shoes. They were like two grand. So cute. And then these are from Olgana. These are $900, so slightly cheaper. But both of them, I have pretty direct knockoffs. Both from Lola's. Cape Robin is actually the brand if you want to check them out on Instagram. They're super cool. Um, but these are like the fluffiest little bedroom shoes is kind of what they reminded me of. Every time I wear them, so many men compliment me on them. It's almost creepy. It kind of makes me want to stop wearing them, but not really because I love them. They're so fun. Um, pretty much direct dupes. I am obsessed. Love. Okay, so this one's not an exact dupe at all. It's just a similar style. Um, I wouldn't have really even put them in the video aside of the fact that I'm obsessed with them and they were $13, so they needed to be featured, but look how cute these are. Oh, ho, ho, I love them. I got them yesterday um, when I was downtown shopping. I knew they were a knockoff of some brands, but I'm not sure which one. Um, so I Googled around. This, this was the closest thing I could find, um, but these are $1,200. So I would say a uh, pretty good dupe for 13 bucks. Holy shit, these are cute. <laughs> $13, you guys. $13. Hey, 
All right, now this next pair of boots I can't even find online. I don't know who the hell sells Yeezys because the only place I can even find them at all listed online is on eBay for like two grand. Where are your shoes, Kanye? Where are they hiding? It's okay, not like I would buy them anyway because <gasps> I've got these little babies. These are Kim K's custom um, Yeezy season two boots that she wore at the Revolve party, which is such a look. I just love this, so simple and cute. Anyways, this is not a love video about Kim. I'll make one of those another day. But um, these boots are such a cute dupe. Now I personally hate to say it, but I don't even like the Yeezy ones that much because I don't like the chunky heel. I just think that the thinner heel like is kind of sexier and makes my legs look a little better. But these are fantastic. I, you've seen them featured in a bunch of my other videos and I always get so many questions about them. They are to die for and not to mention super cheap for boots anyway. This one is kind of random, but I felt like I could not just not share this with you guys. Um, I've wanted to get an Adidas, like, all-white superstar sneaker for a while now, but they're, like, 80 bucks, which is totally, I mean, you could get it. It's definitely, like, more of a splurge item to me anyways. Um, but I definitely wanted to get the look, and I found these when I was downtown shopping at Lola's yesterday for $6.99. So definitely not an exact dupe like the other ones, but super close. You can totally still get the look, and for $7 compared to $80, I'll take it. All right, last pair of shoes we're gonna do are these. So basic, but so cute. Classic little Tom Ford um, sandals. Every celebrity known to mankind has this pair of shoes, um, which is why I got them myself. Um, I'd actually mentioned in a different video that I got these at Lola's, but I was mistaken. These are actually kind of old, but you can see I got them at Forever 21 for like $30. Um, they do have similar pairs at Lola's still, so I'll loop, link you to those, but these are just so cute, so simple, and look great with just about, well, oops, but they do look great with just about anything. So there you have it, you guys. Those are my top picks for the best designer dupes 2016. Um, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, as always, hit me up in the comment section below. I really do try to answer all of them, but in the last few days, like, I literally sat on the computer for over... <laughs> like 10 hours it's so embarrassing I just sit at home um and I still couldn't get to them all so I'm trying though I am um if you want more of an immediate response snapchat me because um I'm pretty good about that and there's not as much of an overflow in there yet um but anyways as always all my socials are at amber Scholl, so hit me up on there I love you guys so much you have no idea how much this means to me um I love you guys thank you kisses till next time have an amazing day and go buy some shoes because treat yourself, you deserve it. <laughs> okay, see you guys. Those are my picks for the top designer. Do if I get one more, ah, you guys, you're blowing up my Snapchat <laughs> too much. I can't like do anything when you I need to, well, I guess I could just silence my phone. Uh, yeah.